Hello once again everyone, Original Blood Ace here with a quick video on Ubisoft once again. Ah, <sighs> the fourth patch for Assassin's Creed Unity. <laughs> Came out the other day. And, uh... <laughs> 40 gigabytes. For a patch. Now, before you freak out, I do need to clarify that this was a glitch. It's a 6.7 gigabyte patch. But... On the Xbox One version of Assassin's Creed Unity, there was a glitch bumping it all the way up to a 40 gigabyte patch. That's ridiculous. Because apparently it was having causing a thing where it would replace your entire uh, game install data, like of the actual game itself, and then it would reinstall it with the patch installed. But even still... A 6.7 gigabyte update, a patch, is fucking ridiculous. This is the fourth patch, remember? Remember there was the patch earlier that fixed supposedly 300 bugs. <sighs> or over 300 bugs, technically. <laughs> Man, it's a good thing Assassin's Creed Unity didn't come to the Wii U. Because... The Wii U's memory is 32 gigabytes if you have the black one. You wouldn't be able to do these patches. <laughs> you'd have to be you'd have to be happy with a broken game unless you had an external hard drive. Which is another good thing about Wii U that you don't have to install every fucking game to the damn system. So I guess maybe that's why Microsoft and Sony always do their huge hard drives because of all the dislocked content that you don't get on the disc, uh, mandatory installing games, um, patch after patch after patch, which is going to you know, end up being probably 10 gigabytes by the time you get all the patches done. And so that's really eating away at your hard drive. But luckily that doesn't affect the Wii U. So I'll read it here. The fourth Assassin's Creed Unity patch released yesterday, uh, and Xbox One users found that it was substantially larger than advertised. The update, which was meant to be 6.7 gigabytes, clocks in at 40 gigabytes <laughs> on the Microsoft console. The only thing getting assassinated around here anytime soon is your hard drive. Now apparently, uh, no, not Assassin's Creed, Ubisoft talked about this, and they're like, oh, it was a bug, we're working with Microsoft to fix it, blah, blah, blah. And you know what the funny thing is, is that Microsoft charges upwards to 50 grand to a developer for every patch they do on a game, on their console. And if Microsoft has been doing that, they could be, that mean, could be, or that could mean Ubisoft has paid $200,000 to do these four patches. <laughs> I'm so glad that stupid, shitty, broken games aren't on the Wii U. So, like I said, this is a good thing that if this was on the Wii, we would have been screwed with a broken version, and then, you know, we wouldn't be capable of downloading an update. And you could blame Nintendo on, on not giving us enough memory, but what's the point of giving us all this extra memory if it's just going to be filled up with patches, you know? If it's just going to be filled up with updates. <sighs> if you want a game console that has quality... You gotta go with the Wii U, or even PC, even though that's not a console. But, I think that's all I need to talk about. That's all I need to say. <laughs> I get so tired of talking about Ubisoft. But, uh, yeah, I guess that'll do it. Stick around. I'm Original Blood Ace. More videos coming soon, as always.